Hi, it's Don Strankowski with the Send Career and Life Strategies. Hey, I just wanted to check in with you today and just make sure everything's going okay. There's a lot going on right now uh, in the world. It, it really doesn't matter what major news site that you, you read or where you get your news from. Um, there's just a lot of uncertainty, and it seems like our country especially is just facing a lot of challenges right now. But I just want to really encourage you to, to stay focused on, on your goals, on your purpose, on your mission. It's, it's more important right now than at any other time. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of things that we, we can't control right now, but there's a lot of things that we still can. And I just want to encourage you maybe to hit that reboot button or that reset button and just kind of rededicate yourself to being the best version of you that, that you possibly can. Uh, remember, we can always choose how we treat our bodies, our, our health. Uh, if you're in between positions right now, and boy, unfortunately, a lot of people are, uh, you can focus on your job search and what are you doing on a daily basis. And even if you're presently employed, how can you create uh, as much value as you can for the company and become the best that you can uh, in your occupation right now? So there's a lot of things that, that we can control. And at the end of the day, we can control our thoughts. Uh, I know there's a lot of negativity and a lot of gravity right now, and that's why it's so important just to say focus on your best self, your true self, and you know really try to hit those goals that you've set for yourself over the course of time and just don't let the negativity of the moment uh, take you off course. So the attitude of positive expectancy goes, goes a long way. And I know we can't go through life with rose-colored glasses. We have to be realistic. But uh, making a plan, uh, the old axiom holds true. Expecting the, the best for preparing for the worst, right? So you need to have some contingency plans in place right now. But have that attitude of positive expectancy. You're a pro. You've been there. You know how to get things done. You know, there's this whole set of mental laws, universal laws of success, and they are just as real as some of the physical laws, like laws of physics and gravity and thermodynamics and, and things like that. One of my favorite uh, mental laws of success is called the law of control, and it says that we feel as good about ourselves to the degree that we feel we are in control. So once again, I go back to focus, focus on who you are, your best self, your passion, what you're trying to achieve, family goals, professional goals, personal goals, whatever they may be, stay focused and don't waver on the course of, of where you want to get to. And I mentioned a little bit earlier that, you know, sometimes we do have to hit that, that reset button and that's okay. I hit a a mini reset button practically every single day. There are things that are really important to me that I make time for and they go into my outlook like everything else. And I'll share a couple of those with you. Number one is my health. Uh, a lot of you know me personally and you know I'm kind of a health nut, not just because I live in Boulder, Colorado, but that's just who I am. So uh, every single day I go two and a half miles in the morning with, with my dog before it gets really, really hot. And then I'll work, and then um, I go two and a half miles again. And if it's I run, uh, if it's too hot with my dog, I don't take her, but we go hiking and do another two and a half miles. So I'm always going about five miles a day. That's really, really important to me. I, I'm not comfortable going to the gym right now. Some of you might be that that's fine. But uh, back in March, I put together a, a garage gym, and you know I can do about 90% of what I was doing at the health club in my garage. And so that's that's fine for the time being here. So, but, but my health is definitely number one. Um, also stay focused on your other professional goals. And I know we're kind of living in a, a society right now of entrepreneurs, people starting businesses, and that's really exciting. And uh, we kind of have the side hustle culture going on right now, which is also exciting where, you know, people are working their jobs, but they got these little side businesses going and you know, I'm working with a woman right now, and she's a, a fantastic artist, and she has a full-time job, and she uh, has like watercolor paintings, and so she set up a, a website, and she's selling some of her work online, and that's just really exciting that, you know, people are looking at it and, and purchasing it and so forth. So stay focused on you, and if there's other things that you've been putting off, you know, now might be the time to, to kind of reinvestigate that a little bit, but um, and. I completely understand if the energy is not where it was maybe a number of months ago and we have to set that 
hit that reset button a little bit. So do what you need to do to, to reset. And maybe it is getting on a health program or getting another degree or finishing a degree or getting that certification or starting that side business. But just start working on something, not because you feel you have to, but you feel you want to. So think about what you believe in and what you're passionate about and see what you can do. Maybe it's just writing a blog or starting an Instagram account and taking some pictures or something like that. But do what really makes you feel good and what makes you feel whole and you know, where you get out of bed in the morning and say, hey, you know what, I'm really going to knock this out today. I'm going to you know, challenge you at least to, to take something like a, a notebook here and where I keep all my ideas and, and write something down that, that really jazzes you. Okay, that's about all I wanted to say for today. I just really encourage you to uh, take small steps. And if you have to get back into the game, that's fine. Let's set some mini goals and win some mini battles here. And I know you are going to get to where you want to go. So if you have any questions, look me up at ascendcareers.net or you can email me at don at ascendcareers.net. I would love to hear from you. And I like to answer emails from people who have questions too. So... You have a fantastic day. Stay positive. Remember, maintain that attitude of positive expectancy, and I will check in with you later.